So now... Spoilers! The game fucking talk! Yeah! Aunt <laughs> May is dead! She's done! It's over! She died! She's not coming back! She's not coming back! That's it! What did you That's talk it. about? Yo, I'm gonna pour a little bit out for Aunt May real quick. Nah, not really, because I don't want to ruin the floors or nothing. <laughs> For the first time on the channel, please welcome Bex. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bex, uh, would you like to lead us in the spoiler section of the of yeah, the so, stuff? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> talking to the mic. Talking to the mic. <laughs> oh my god. Do you not see my shirt? Like. <laughs> she was in the movie. Not just kidding. The whole shirt is a spoiler. <laughs> exactly. Yo. That's why I did not want to say it. <laughs> is done. Um. Okay. So I'm gonna angle your mic real quick. Hello. <laughs> so, like, as we know, Aunt May dies. I was not surprised, honestly. <laughs> Why were you not surprised? Somebody had to die. Mm. I'm just saying somebody, if it wasn't Zendaya, it was going to be her. It was either Happy or Aunt May. Damn. Why would Happy die? I, I, if, no, if Happy, Happy died, can't I die. Like, oh. I don't think, no, yeah. they can't do it because Happy's literally been with us since the beginning. Like, yeah. Iron yeah, Man. Yeah, yeah. Like, nah, nah. like he... respect on Happy. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Man, listen. A, bro. Exactly. <laughs> Are we forgetting about Thank Black you. Widow? She, she sacrificed herself. Though, she ain't sacrificed world. shit. No, but she made that decision. But we're not talking about her right now. We're talking yeah. about Spider-Man. Okay? We're not talking about oh, Justice. I'm sorry. <laughs> I love her, but we're not talking about her right now. You just Let her rest in peace. Let her rest in peace. Is that right? So, all right, let's do like a, a breakdown from beginning to end. Yeah. Her like, I feel like how everything just piled up so nice and beautifully. Like fucking butter. Mm. Oh. <laughs> so basically, like, yo, they straight from the beginning, they jump into like from leaving off from the other movie. Mm -hmm. They're like, yo, he's Spider Man. That's it. Blah blah blah. It literally. And he's like mad, right uncomfortable. Here. Fucking. And then he's like, yo, people need to leave us alone. He's getting rejected from college because controversy. All right. That. I mean. Nah, I understood that actually. I was gonna be like, eh, it makes sense. Cause nah, it think does. about like celebrities, like when they have to apologize for. Yeah, no, oh, that's I'm sorry, true. I was racist on Twitter. And three then, years uh, yeah, ago. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and they thought he was a murderer and everything. So yeah. he goes to Doctor Strange. And he's like, "Yo, tell everybody to forget about me." He's like, "Bet." And he goes, "Wait, hold up." But then he goes, "Nah, J.K." And then, <laughs> <laughs> and then yeah, and then Strange was like, "Oh, I, I concealed the the time, whatever the fuck, in the square." You 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 leaving out a couple of they. They was they was there and yeah, Tom yeah. was like, wait, but I don't want my girlfriend to ever get a lolly. I need them cheeks. To get <laughs> <laughs> and he's like, oh no, nah, I can't. Oh man, I need all oh, made to it too. Oh wait, and he did it like six times and like yeah. that's how everything fucked up. And then he, he yeah. was just like, my nigga, you need to relax. You you know, yeah. okay, now that you just said that about him saying Aunt May and all that, it would have been okay had he just left her out of the spell because she was gonna die anyway. So bro, right hey, then and there, he could have just taken off his mask okay, and be like, I mean, man, it's me. I'm you sorry. Don't think she's gonna die though. No, but I think, like, but the we, whole world forgot who he was towards the end. Like, th that thing that was the spell, like, everyone forgetting who he is. Like, As it was Parker, odd. Yeah. It was, it even, bro, even happy, Parker. even happy yeah. forgot. He was everybody. like, yo, who is this? Yeah. It was just everybody forgot that he was a person. It was like he got snapped out of existence by Thanos, but not physically. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, literally. Because, like, everyone knows that Spider-Man mm -hmm. exists, but they don't know who the person behind yep. Spider-Man is. Like, that whole moment is just completely yep. and then the, erased. No, you're right. And then they were just there chilling, and then Peter was trying to get back to college, and then Doc, I just came out of nowhere. Yo. Hello, Peter. Hello, Peter. <laughs> Hello, Peter. And then he was hey, like, wait, Peter. you're not Peter, Peter. <laughs> he was like, you're not Peter, too. So. <laughs> oh, Peter. <laughs> He's like, wait, you're not Toby McQuarrie. Yo, what film is this? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that was dead ass Doc Ogg, like, the whole time. He's like, bro. What is this? Why, why these things on? got me cacti? Why He's are like, they doing magic? His tentacles were like, yo, bro, you see this shit? He's like, <laughs> <laughs> nah, he you know like what was fire when Spider-Man took, yo, he was like, yo, let me, let me control your shit. <laughs> yeah, I like that. That was cool. That was cool. Which is, which is, uh, I love that because, um, they tend to forget that Peter Parker is a smart motherfucker. There you go. He's like, smart as fuck. Like, and a lot of the movies like seem to forget that. I was watching, um, I never seen Andrew Garfield's uh, The Second Amazing Spider-Man. Yeah. So I took a, a, a watch at it. That, that movie's ass. 
It's but, hard, bro. I don't know what you're talking about. It's just hard. Ass. It's ass. It's not. Anyway, it's not. but they don't really like show like, oh, he's smart. This nigga's watching YouTube videos to see how to beat Jamie Foxx, which is dumb to me because like <laughs> it's Peter Parker. He's mad smart. Like I find that so crazy. Yo, if he if he loses a fight to Spider Man, he could just blame it on ah 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 ah. Bro, 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 bro. Spoilers. Toby McGuire, Andrew Garfield. That shit was crazy. Oh, oh my god, hold up. Let me let me let me send this text because he over here sending text. Andrew. We don't care. No, Fuck no, your text, up. nigga. Matter of fact, Scarlett Johansson, pull up to the Bronx. What did you talk about? I'm trying to get at you, mommy. Take a spin on the cyclone. I miss you. <laughs> I miss you. Damn, I should call her. I'm not gonna lie, when he came out, Stand it was patient. mad legendary. The whole yeah. theater is just like, oh! See, now, I, was like, I was like, that's my boy, let him see, do See, now that made me tear. Aunt May did not. I tear. <laughs> I know I, that sounds funny. No, no, like what I like too, it was just very sudden. So the way the other Spider-Mans came out, mind you, let's hold up, let's backtrack a little bit. All Peter wanted to do is help these motherfuckers. Mm -hmm. And yeah, these motherfuckers ended hero. up, and these motherfuckers ended up killing on May, and he goes, "Nah, I need like he needed help." And I'm glad how was just like, "Bring Peter Parker," and then Andrew's like, "Oh, I, that's me." Other people, you, you yeah, think, you and bro, I'm not gonna lie, I, cl I even clapped when Andrew came out. I was like, "Oh my boy!" <laughs> Mind you, by the way, the way they wrote Andrew Garfield's lines was yeah. way yeah. better great. than the Amazing Spider-Man movies. John Watts was like. I want to make him good, actually. Exactly. So, like, <laughs> bro, I actually felt sympathetic for him. He, I, yo, I was like, y'all want to give you a hug, bro. You dead as the, like, the low-tier spider. And when he fucking, like, he catches Zendaya. Yo! I, I, mind you, I saw that movie, like, a couple of days ago, so, or probably, like, the day before. So, for me, it was just like, oh, He got his man, redemption, yes. bro. Yeah. There, there yeah. you go. You got, you got your girl. You the got your girl. The emotion in his face. I was just like, why couldn't he be like this in his movie? Bro, I would Andrew, have enjoyed his movie a lot. Right, better. Andrew yeah, killed it. Wow. I, I, it I really loved him. And then, and then, like when, and then when there was like, oh, let me find the other Peter Parker. I've and always then, wanted bro, brothers. Bro, the way Toby <laughs> just came out was like a gangster, bro. Like, cause like there was like shadow in his face. Mm -hmm. But then when he got out the portal, you see him and you're like, bro. I've been looking for you guys. I was yes, like, you I was have. like, they, I was like, yes, they, you have. I was like, they fucking did it. They really did it. All the rumors, leaks, all that shit was real. And I feel like Bro, Marvel was the one that leaked it. They, <laughs> I feel, you low key, I feel like I feel that's like Marvel, Marvel leaked, leaked it. Does. Marvel was like, yo, let me leak it so they could think. It's something the publicity. Else. They gotta get people talking. Guys, I want you to think about this. And Disney, if you're if you're watching, I'm I'm on to you. All right. Sponsor us, Disney. Check, no, 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 no. I'm I'm on to their bullshit, yo. Check it out. They they will they will not only leak stuff ahead of time when it's fire, but they will go through extra precautions to make sure shit doesn't leak when something's trash. Did y'all hear anything about Eternals before it came out? Nope. nope. Did y'all hear anything about okay. Black Widow when it came but the out? Thing of, the nah. thing about Eternals is, um, who the fuck is Eternals? <laughs> yeah, nobody really knows I'm not gonna lie, I wasn't very fond of Eternals. I know Doris is looking at me like, what do you mean? <laughs> I gave you like a 20 minute explanation. I was explaining <laughs> it to you. No, I, I, no, no, no. Nah, no. no, shout out Doris. She okay, did. No, the, she, the she did. Mutants, but, uh, she, Scarlet, uh, what was it? What was this? She, she did explain Black everything. Widow? Like, nah, all right. I didn't. I, I, I didn't care because it was a prequel. Because I, I was like, I want to know what's going on now, bro. It just yeah. wasn't done well, though. Like I don't think. And then, it was and done then, well. COVID kind of like got in between it and everything. That, that's the what just happened. Up the timeline. Right. That's what it did. That's what I think. That's what really happened. But like, this movie. Oh my god! It's just. Oh my god! The thing is, they were good at like hiding. All of that shit, though. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, you know what? You know what they did hide, and they did bring him, my motherfucking Matt Murdock. Let's Yo. go! Word. I screamed. Yo, I'm not gonna I lie. Screamed. I'm not gonna lie. I had to, I, like, cause remember, like, people were like, "Oh, his arms look like Matt Murdock's arms from their Devil series," and I was like, "Oh, they did bunk that already. That that's not him." But then he just came out of nowhere. Yo, this is the first time that like a Netflix adaptation Marvel character jumps into the MCU. Right. Like I'm not gonna count Agent Coulson because he like he went from MCU to Nef to TV series. And Agents of Shield is trash. Though. No, it's not. Well, the <laughs> ending was trash, but I think it's okay. Only only the season with Ghost Rider is good. That's it. You know what? You're absolutely. Oh, I haven't seen right, that. So like, yeah, Ghost Rider is in Agents of Shield. Oh, that's fire. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, the thingy, that. yo, the thing with the thing and the thing and the thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh oh oh! Spoilers yeah. for Hawkeye. Kingpin is in Hawkeye, so I I was like. 
Oh I had texted Kevin early. I'm like, yo, watch watch Hawkeye. And we did. Yo, literally, like, a few hours before we went to the theaters, me and Doris was like, yo, let's watch the last Hawkeye. That shit was crazy. I saw King Pooh. I was like, let's go. Yeah, that, nah, that was good. That I, I like that King Pooh was there. But nah, and then, nah, and then to show even, like, to show that Matt Murdock is also a gangster, when they threw the break, it was like, yo, it, I'm, I was I'm like, yeah, 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 talk to my I'm son nice. Talk to my son nice. And then, you know, even Peter was like, yo, how you do that? And he's like, I'm a really good lawyer. That's all I'm saying. That's I'm all, a I'm a good lawyer. <laughs> yo, they, I can't believe they did that and they didn't have like Peter and, the, okay, this is the one thing that I like, that I will criticize the movie for. If you're gonna have Daredevil in the fucking movie and have him break his blind illusion to everybody, you gotta have him and Peter go to the side and be like, "Yo, bro, listen, like, don't tell nobody else, but I'm I'm actually this dude in the red suit." Downtown he can't do that though. And shoot the fair one. I think, it, I, I think so. For me, I think it would have been like um. The, like uh, let's say the lizard is on the loose or some shit like that, and you see Daredevil fighting the lizard, and then um, it, it's Peter, so the the he's gonna figure it out. Oh, that's Peter. Like his little tingly. But tingly. And, and, and he he's not gonna know that it's Matt Murdock. But at least we got to see Daredevil on the screen. No, yeah, that's that's, that's the most important part. Mm -hmm. And then when they, I, I, bro, and then it's the little things too that matter in this movie, like the little interactions with all three Spider Man. Oh my yeah. God, yeah, I love when he was just like. The, the webs come out your wrist. <laughs> Where you come from, bro? They coming out your asshole too. <laughs> <laughs> and Toby's just like, yo, bro, relax. Well, yeah, smack, bro, it's like, yo, <laughs> literally, yo, Toby was like, my nigga, we got fig bigger fish to fry. Like, yeah. don't bring that up. Fish to fry. Fish. All right, yo, let me. Frish. Yo, oh my God, walk away, walk away. <laughs> Walk away. No, come back, bro. Come back. <laughs> Gary, come Yo, really home. Really quick, though. Like, the fight between uh, Tom Holland and Willem Dafoe. Willem. Oh, my fucking God. The first fight. Yeah. The second. The Yo, he really whipped his ass. Bro, he was like, mink, mink. So, so, he flipped him, too, and then flipped him again, and then just started decking him. That shit yep. crazy. Yo, spoiler oh, yeah, alert. Bomb. Yeah. Yo, they was in the fucking building like, boom, 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 all through the fucking building. Bro, so, fucking spoiler alert, Green Goblin basically kills May, and then Peter's just like, nah, yeah, it's Cliff for this nigga, I gotta get him. So, the final battle is Green Goblin and Tom Holland. So, they're fighting and shit, and Tom Holland is, they're showing you, like, he's not pulling his punches, because they're fighting, like, on this metal uh platform thing. It's like Captain America's show, but it's, like, really, really big. So he punches <laughs> down, and you hear the fucking uh, the metal break, the cling, mm -hmm. and it's just like, oh shit, no, he really means it, like he's really like about he wants to kill to this fuck him up. So yeah. he's just mink, mink, <laughs> mink, mink. Like I, I can't even describe like a fight, like like Goku getting his ass whooped, like <laughs> Superman getting his ass whooped by um motherfucking uh what what's the guy's name that beat Superman's ass? Damn, uh, there were. Dude. <sighs> Doomsday beating Doomsday, Superman's yeah. ass. Spider-Man was just destroying Green Goblin like that. And you're just like, damn, Peter, relax. <laughs> so the craziest moment in that fight, that end fight scene for me is when is when Green Goblin was like, it was you. I may have been the one who struck the final blow, but you, you're the one who killed her. And Bro. I was like, what? <laughs> Bro, and then, and then fucking Tom Holland picks up uh, the Green Goblin glider and he's like, I'm about to stab this nigga. It's clip. It's clip. Toby McGuire comes and they're it's just like they're talking with their eyes. He's just like, yes. you don't want to do this. That was a beautiful scene because like Yo, Toby that. was like, my guy, I am you. I know what you're going through. No. Don't do this. Don't it, do this. It kind of that fight also kind of resembled in Toby Maguire Spider-Man when they were fighting. And then he's like, It's me. It's me. And he's yeah. like, negative. I'm he's tricking like, you. Like that I kind of felt like a resemblance in that fight as well. Yeah, and also like when true. he was trying to look for the guy that um killed Ben, the mm -hmm. way he hunted him down, it was just like boom. It was that like, same it, it was the same feeling, all the same feeling. That's why when he was like, Don't tell me that you understand. He's like, Bro, I just lost Gwen Stacy. She fell off a building. Mm -hmm. I lost Ben, I yeah, like, 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 like Andrew and Toby were like, nigga. Yeah. Like, like <laughs> who him, we are. To him, to him, it, it didn't just happen, it but to them, it literally just fucking happened. Yup, yeah. and, and I like that because it's like literally 
the the one the one person that Peter needed to hear this from and get sympathy from and have a companionship of is with another version of yeah. himself. That was because again they've gone through it. They've lost somebody, so they're like, "Yo, like I know how it feels." Yeah, bro, it it's not gonna make things better. Like yeah. that was the perfect Ooh. empathy. Like he, those were the perfect solutions for his he problem. Said before Aunt May died, she said, "With great power comes." Great responsibility. How you know, bro? He's like, ben <laughs> Uncle Ben said it. He's like, who the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> who, who that? What, the dude on the rice? The spider <laughs> too. It also what? gave me into the Spider-Verse vibes, too. Definitely. Like, you know how oh, like, yeah, that whole true. scene when, when, he's fu- when Miles is meeting all the different spider you know, people, and then um, Aunt May is there like, it's time that you came, man. And they're all like, we understand. I mm-hmm. lost my Uncle Ben like this. And I lost my person like this. And it's like, oh, boo-hoo. Okay, let's go save the world now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> like, it was just like very <laughs> impassing. Nobody yeah. really. You know, I low-key feel like this was um, Tom Holland's, uh, Spider-Man's real origin story. Because w- the way oh. they began, you know what I'm trying to say? Yeah, because yeah. Homecoming was kind of yeah. just like... Literally, right? Homecoming was just, was just Spider-Man. like... after. Yeah, Homecoming was just after Civil War. So they just wanted... All right. Everybody knows about the Uncle Ben shit. Everybody exactly. knows this, that, and the third. Let's just... But now you really let, let, let's, just put, let's just Uncle put... Let's just put... Let's just put Spider Man and Peter Parker in the MCU. That's, My thing that's is, what is okay. I I I yeah. see it as like so for Spider Man in general. I read the comics, uh, in a, in like in originality, it's like okay, Uncle Ben dies, so now I'm gonna do good. So for for me, it's just like I to think about it. I guess he's doing good because he saw like the Avengers and shit. Like oh okay, they're doing yo, good. By, I'm gonna do good. By the way, I thought that that I thought that scene was funny when like Peter was like, "Yo, I've worked as a team before." What I was in, I was in the Avengers. Toby's like, "Yo, that's crazy." What what, are the what's Avengers? that? The basketball team? <laughs> yeah. Nah, nah. This dude was like, yeah. Andrew was like, "Yo, you in a band, my nigga?" Like, <laughs> <laughs> the Avengers. I, I love that because Toby was like, yeah, like the sarcasm. He was like, yo, that's that's great. Who's the Avengers though? <laughs> that's that, that New York like, shit. Yeah, bro. That's that New York. That, He's like, who the fuck is that, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, Toby Mugar's on his fucking New York shit. He was like, yo, that's crazy, but what the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> that's wild. Literally. Yo, that's wild. Nah, nah, yo. What? That's crazy. <laughs> Literally. Nobody cares. <laughs> yo. yo, that's bad. Damn. Oh, man. Yo, by the way, you guys uh, keep talking. I'm going to go order my food. Yeah, yo. So why don't we... Why don't we come to a conclusion uh i mean bex what is your on the block score for for spider-man no way home oh for like i would say oh wow no words duh <laughs> on the mutant bex meter it's mutant out of mutant okay cerebral's getting everything right oh, now shit. hold on mutant hey. out of mutant. Cerebral? Okay. we getting Everything up yeah. in here. All right, brother. You're in the comics. <laughs> or right. the anime. I don't know. Nah, yeah. This I'm... review is Spider Man No Words. <laughs> Literally, Spider Man No Words. Not 11, no words 11 out of 10. Definitely a great introduction for the next phase. Also, because I know, like, in the comic books and shit like that, Spider Man's supposed to be, like, the leader of everything, pretty much. And I was watching, like, a recap on YouTube as well, and they were saying, like, you know, he's pretty much taking the, the role of Iron Man now. So this is, like, good yeah. training for him. But also, one last thing I would have to say is that we have to remember he's still a kid. So, of course, he's going to make some naive ass decisions. Oh, yeah. Let me, let me <laughs> add into that. I feel like after this, because they, they um confirmed that there's going to be a sequ- there's gonna be a fourth installment. Three. There's they better be. be. There's three more <laughs> spiders. Yep. So, this is going to be his college. This is going to be college era Spider-Man. Also, like, older. So, what yeah. do you Which mean? Which is like- uh, Dan Slott's era of Spider-Man. And, yep. oh, my God. So would you say yes, it's like sir. more closer to the game then, minus the no. fact that Maze uh, already did? Well, <laughs> it's funny because I feel like this movie borrowed from the game a little That's bit what with I'm the on May situation and everything, except yeah. it was like oh, no, poison. No, so actually, uh, there's a there's a comic called um, it's uh, a new day or some shit. A new day is a new day. So that's, the one that that's where on May, on May dies, and that's where Mephisto and, lies in too. Yeah. So what <laughs> happens? Is, um, he Mary Jane and Peter were married at one point, and Mephisto was like. If you uh want Aunt May to come back to life, uh you gotta give me your marriage, which is mad corny. Everybody hated it. I think it's cool. What, like a divorce? No, like he's like you and Mary Jane never got married. 
that's it. So like, like they never meet, they never anything. Yeah, like they never got married. Yeah, they probably dated. And, and they and they um and John Watts, I feel like borrows some of that. He from, borrowed a lot from that uh that comic. Yeah, yeah specifically. Erasing Peter it's Parker. funny because I heard like I, I I've heard from in the comic book lore like that was one of the like bad, that was a bad comic. It, there's people who say it's good. There's people who say it's bad. But yeah, it's I've heard some people think it's like, oh shit, like it, it was interesting. Like when you read further into it and shit like that, it, it just gets even crazier. Like, um, what ha- what's supposed to happen after this shit is like Spider Island. Oh, by the way, oh, I'm getting the mic. Uh, where like Spider Island, uh, everybody gets like spider powers and shit like that. And my favorite thing is, uh, it leads into su- Superior Spider Man, which is there's uh Spider Man is called. Uh, as Peter Parker, like, yo, Doc Ock is on his deathbed, and he's like, I want to see Peter Parker. Can you guys bring him here? Oh, shit. And Peter Parker comes, and Doc Ock just tells this whole story about Peter Parker, like, having a, a face-off against Doc Ock and shit. And Doc Ock says, you you won. You did it. This is your... This is... You won. That, and that sounds... You won, uh, Dr. Octavius, to Peter. And it turns out that... uh. Doc Ock is in Peter, and he changed their minds. So Peter's the one that's dying as Doc. What Ock. the? Whoa! Yeah. What? Yeah. So if they that's lead into crazy. that, imagine seeing that on the big screen. Oh, I'm like, oh They did it. They switch bodies. You mean they switch bodies and uh, some apocalypse shit. So what happens is uh the the series the entire series actually changes into Superior Spider Man, and Doc Ock actually makes Peter Parker rich. He uh, starts inventing all this shit. He becomes basically the Tony Stark of the Marvel Universe. Ooh. At that point, he gets like uh, Parker Industries. Aunt May marries J. Jonah Jameson. What? That's uh, hilarious. Just, and like he has like this this orange suit where it's just like insane. Um, just go read like Dan Slott stuff. Like shout out Dan Slott. I met him one time. He's amazing. That sounds nice. Actually really makes me want to read it now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, like, it, yo, it's like. <laughs> Oh my God, Dan Slott, the way he wrote, like, just, you you write Peter Parker's death, and everybody was just like, you can't kill Peter Parker, but for these, uh, for these, uh, authors, they just say, I can do whatever the fuck I want, I'm the author, like, you're not gonna tell me what to do. Yup, and that's the best thing, well, yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, you gotta know your audience, so it's like, if you have, like, a, I don't give a shit attitude, and your fans have the same thing too. He's like, yo, give me more of that. Like, I don't care. Exactly. Yeah, and that's why like, even Jason Aaron, Aaron is so amazing because he took away Thor's power in the comics. He took away Thor's power and he made Jane Foster, uh, a female, you know, the Thor. And everybody's like, you can't is make, she uh, she has, she had cancer and, uh, but like, and then it, that saved her. No, it didn't save her. Like she still had cancer. Mjolnir she was still only dying. Made her like strong when she held it. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. yeah. So, uh, eventually, she she doesn't die, but yeah, it you under you got to read it. I I don't, I don't really want to spoil that. I like that a lot. Right. I I think female Thor is better than male Thor, like hands down. Probably Damn. one of the best series I've ever read. Damn. All right. So what do you think? I think we covered a lot. We covered this this movie what front to back. One what more else? thing, though. What, what else? else? What else? What else? What else? One more thing. thing. What about? Okay, so like they obviously made a jab about Miles Morales. Do you think yeah. that oh, that means yeah. they'll Jimmy like Fox. introduce him oh, into yes. the MCU? So, uh, oh yeah, let me get yeah, into more into. Sure. J- I'm gonna get into that. Let me get into more Jamie Fox though. Like, <laughs> yes. so have y'all noticed in the Amazing Spider Man? Wasn't he kind of like a nerd, yeah. like personality? In this one, he was more like a thug. <laughs> it was just Jamie Fox being himself. Because he was in New York. Yeah, I think, what I think it was. I think it was. Uh, they they were making those people, or maybe they were in that universe. Yeah, or this was like afterwards. So basically, like he's in jail, so he kind of got like tough enough. I mean, type no, shit. but they say like, yeah, no, nigga, you died. Like we heard that you died. Yeah, yeah, that's true. And then Jamie Fox, the and cool. then Jamie Fox was like, "Yo, bro, you help poor people. You live in Queens. I thought you were black." Yeah, that's <laughs> yeah. And then he was like, "Yo." Imagine a black Spider-Man. Like, what was it? Was it like yeah. that line? He yeah, said yeah, he I'm was a, like, "I'm sure there's a th- there's a black Spider-Man yeah. somewhere, that's and there saying. is, and he's not only black. He's Puerto Rican. Yeah, he's that Puerto ass. Rican. Yeah. Shout out to the Puerto Rican <laughs> Hispanic vibes out here. Ba, 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 ba. Wait, wait, this is a message to Gwen. Get your shoes off my damn bed. <laughs> Disrespectful Yo. ass. How dare oh you? Sounds about white. <laughs> Sounds about. <laughs> Yo, right. Oh, I was going to say one more thing. Just one final yeah, thing. One final thing. Um, so, Andrew said after Gwen died, he went on this, like, crazy rampage. 
I think they can, or if they want to, I don't know what they're fucking going to do, but I think they can either make a series or another film or like even an episode where they can show us that. But like that would be the cool. MCU, because I yeah. would love to see like, yeah, I went crazy and I, I started killing motherfucking Rhino. I killed motherfucking who, uh, Scorpion, whoever else is there. And yeah, like, oh, in the what if series, oh, wait, yeah. by the way, oh, you, oh, oh, I don't oh, even oh, make oh, it. A what I forgot to tell you guys. I, I forgot to tell you guys about Mor- Morbius. Um, Vulture's in Morbius. And I think I Scor- Scorpion is going to be in uh, Morbius as well. One oh. more thing. One more One thing. One more thing. One more thing. Do you think? Do you think that Toby and and I mean, you just you just asked part of the question that I'm gonna ask, but like, do you think that they're gonna be in it? Like, Toby's gonna be in it again, and Andrew's nah. gonna be in it again? Nah, I feel nah. like it's a one, I once in a lifetime think, thing. I, I feel like I think that was like, like in a sense them passing the torch officially. Because if you think if you think about yes. it, metaphorically speaking, and in, in symbolism, they were on the Statue of Liberty. What is the Statue of Liberty holding? A torch. They were passing the torch down oh, to Tom. Oh yo, yeah, she, but yo, yeah, she, but this, she, she got she English with uh, a <laughs> <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen, 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 listen. But I have a debate. I, I have I have a counter for you. Bring it. She was not holding a torch in this movie. The she was holding a shield. Well, remember, oh, oh, Spidey and, held the and, shield and, for and, a minute, too. And who did who, who did Steve Rogers give the shield to, though? Falcon. The black Falcon. boy! Ah, the black boy! boy. What? Oh, what? Miles yeah. Morales confirmed! Like, not only was it not a torch, but it was a shield. And not only was the Statue of Liberty not holding it because it fell. It like they she were, like, dropped it. it on her, yeah. They dropped it. She yeah, dropped but I'm it. saying though, like we we saw Steve. It, it, it's basically saying like, like I, I like what she said. It was perfect. It was spot on. Um, yes. She uh he Steve Rogers. He was like yo like here's the shield like this is for you. And of course we saw the whole thing where like are we gonna fu- are, are 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 they gonna fuck with like a black Captain America? Of course. And you know. Some people didn't, but you know we fucking with the black man. What are you talking about? You could also take it as like America has fallen too, because if you go back oh. into Winter, um, the Winter Soldier Falcon series, we have like the anti Captain America who's killing people, and then he gets hired by Juliet Louise Dreyfus, purple stripe lady, mm. and obviously she she's she's hiring people to kill people. I mean, look, she hired Yelena to go after who? Yo, that's my baby. She's sexy Yo. as fuck. Yo, Yelena, I loved you in Midsommar. Yeah. I love you in Black Widow. Pull up! Pull up! I live in the Bronx, 233rd, baby. Oh Your shit caking. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Honestly, she should be a part of the Avengers. Like, she should just yeah. cut the shit out. I, she's my favorite. She's probably my favorite. I think she's going to be the next Black Widow, and they're not bringing, um, what's her favorite? They saying that they're going to bring her back, but I think they're going to do some... Fucked up shit. If they Damn. were to bring her back, it'll obviously be like an anti Natasha. She's probably gonna be like evil. Nah, or I some think it's shit. just gonna be like some. Uh, so she. I'm I don't know. If she's coming back because she tried to sue the shit no, out of they, Disney, they already, bro. They, they, wants to do they it. already. Yeah. They already announced like she. They're working on some secret. Really? Shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but what I think it's exhausted. gonna be. She, nah, she went that nah, Disney they, bread. They, no, they just showed her a bag big enough. She's like, I'm suing you for this much, and they're like, How about we just give you double that to just come back? And she's like, Okay. All right, yeah. bye. <laughs> so I, since they're doing all this multiverse shit, and I said this before, Scarlet Witch can probably bring her back. Oh, um, mm. th- th- she's gonna come from another dimension like Gamora did. Yes, shout out to Doris. I love you because you brought this up. So I feel like remember the What If series. <laughs> remember the What If series. So in the What If series, she mentioned that there was a Black Widow there that like all she wanted was to be part of another universe that like had her like. Her homies and everybody that, you know, she gets her life back to normal, basically. Right. And I think they, the Watcher gives that to her, if I'm not mistaken. So you think yeah. that's Natasha? She's coming back, maybe, she from another universe. Yeah. And you know what's funny? It makes sense because, like, she sued Disney, so they're not in the greatest of terms. So they're just going to replace her. <laughs> and, then, and then add another universe, Natasha, to the story. What, so, like, it's going to be a different actor? Mm-hmm. That, that's my theory. Mm-hmm. That's me and Doris's theory. Oh, well, the next things we have coming up are uh, the Doctor Strange film. We also have, uh, what's the, what the scrolls? Zendaya? Sorry. Zendaya's bae. Nah, nah, I can't say it. Yo, <laughs> Yelena, pull up. Nah, Yelena, I'll f- oh. Yo, let me take this off. Matter of fact, yo, Yelena, my number is 646 Yo, 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 y
don't know. What, how do I? How would I? Perfect. That was perfect. perfect. Beautiful. Perfect. Beautiful. All right. Peace out, guys. MC you all the way. Exactly. Yeah. Let's go. Yo, thank you. Thank you for watching this. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Get ready. Secret invasion. Doctor Strange. Yes. It's about to be we're, crazy. And we're gonna talk we're about, about to go all stupid. that. We're gonna now talk I about let all him that. Talk. And it right here, Jen. And it right here. Plug in, plug in, uh, uh, mutant backs on Twitch. Oh, okay. I'm like, hello, plug in, plug in.